Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you tonight that we are here in your presence. And we thank you for heaven's attention on us tonight. In the name of Jesus. And we thank you that by your power you are attending to every matter in the name of Jesus Christ. This week we announce in the spirit signs in the heavens, signs on the earth below. In the mighty name of Jesus, signs all around us. In the name of Jesus Christ, we prophetically declare signs and wonders in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. We declare miracles in this atmosphere. In the name of Jesus, we saturate the atmosphere with your presence. The presence that is able to give birth to signs and wonders. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you. In Jesus' name for the revelation that shall come. We thank you for the unfolding of your word. In the mighty name of Jesus, the entrance of your word gives light and it gives understanding unto the simple. We thank you that this week you shall elevate us in the spirit. In the name of Jesus Christ. And indeed our lives will never be the same again. In the name of Jesus we thank you that you shall increase our authority. You shall increase our power. You shall increase your grace upon our lives. And we shall dominate in this life and rule and reign with you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ we pray. Amen. And one of the things about the revival is that everyone is looking to be revived. Now, when we are in a revival, I find that Amen. When we are in a revival, you must be on fire. Yeah. You must be willing to be on fire. You never be that are available to be lit on fire by the Holy Spirit. So I'm saying this because I want us to pray. But Jamu was so tender, and as he said, tender, he said, "Tender, he said, 'I just see the same ones.' But he tender, he said, 'I just see the same ones anyway.' So this week, let me first take the opportunity to thank leadership, Yasekaya, for this opportunity, and I I thank them so much. I trust and believe. I trust and believe. I trust and believe that this week. Many times will be changed. Our aim when we minister the gospel is not to seem powerful. Our aim when we minister the gospel is not to come with a different view. Our aim when we minister the gospel is to transform lives, to open your eyes to see who you really are in Christ Jesus. That's our aim. To understand that Christ never and will never condemn you, for there's no condemnation in Christ Jesus. No condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. When you move from that mindset of condemnation, you begin to walk in the freedom of who you are in Christ Jesus, in the freedom of the Spirit, and you begin to dominate and rule with Him. So this week we trust that the Lord will give us knowledge. That will empower us to become better spirits. This fellowship to each and every one of you in fact. I want to thank you all for coming. I want to thank you all for coming and I salute your baby. I want to request that as you have taken in your heart a decision to come today, take a decision to come the entire week. The reason I'm saying that is because we are going to enter into a school, and that school is the school of the spirit. So, calling modules and then are very important 
Today we're going to deal with the matter of what is faith. Right? And we're going to deal with the different aspects of faith so that you understand. Yes, we are to Not because there's no power present, but your faith, the faith of your heart is not open to receive. We are surprised to see the people who are in the city. My city is in the city. So we have to deal with these things. Today we are going to talk about faith. Tomorrow we are going to talk about the power of the Holy Spirit. Mm. And we are going to understand that the mother, I know that the swelling in the layers of what is real. The problem is that we are going to need the lamentas of what is real. Fike, central, and the other one, we are expecting to but if you not just about all of us, and you expect that I am that I could live in your Do you think that the Lord is? Do you think that the Lord shall be doesn't want to give you, or is it that you already have it? Do you think who are people who are not going to make it? Who are not going to Until someone makes me realize I have this water. I will keep asking God, God give me water. God give me water. Until God makes me realize the water is already in my hands. So tomorrow we will talk about power. What is the power of the Holy Spirit? <coughs> And how we will, trusting the Lord for grace, we will do practicals, because it's called Snedon, Sned practicals. We will do practicals on how to use the power within you. Amen. We will talk about healing and deliverance, and how you as a Christian are called by God. We will talk about, is it that healing and deliverance? We will talk about where now how do you pray for people? How do you minister healing and deliverance? Mm -hmm. see now we are going to talk about demons. 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 I just had a thought from someone saying. <laughs> No, we need to be educated as spirits and about our opposition. In order for us to dominate in this world, we need to be educated. A method of prayer. We are going to talk about the fact that we have about it was a night that you tried to God never created it. So we are gonna we are gonna bring an understanding. It demon in God, lingena anja nemtui, the culture anja nemtui. We are zin we are zin jar the kabu with demon in your environment. Do you know when God was just over us here? The angels of the Lord are with us, but demons are also here. And demons are speaking to some people now. Just busted. But now we need to understand as it is so that even the if voices as in get and see understand, but I saw so give voices as someone and as someone and yeah, but as if voices as we are. We're gonna understand the communication of the spirit, and then we're gonna start again. We're gonna talk about the Holy Spirit. So the tragic if we're about to go to the world. Firstly, we are going to pray for our families. Are you going to pray for the That you turn us in the families. We are going to pray for the sick. We are going to pray for those who are bound by drugs and alcohol. See, I've heard about sinning, but the problem is that we don't pray for them enough. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. We don't pray for them enough. I'm not so, 
Because we want them to be saved, we have to win the battle in the spirit through prayer. So we're going to pray today. Secondly, this is a prayer that the Lord has given me that we should pray as we start the week. Ask the Lord this week for the personal testimony. Ask the Lord for a personal testimony. In your life, in your family, ask the Lord for a personal testimony. When you ask the Lord for a personal testimony, there are even no Impossible. Ask the Lord for that. Ask the Lord for that. And this week shall be full of miracles, signs and wonders, full of testimonies in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Oh Lord, we pray for our family today. Let them be included in your message in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, as they cover them with your wings, your wings of protection, we pray. We pray.
spirit of the enemy. I confuse them by the light in Jesus' mighty name. But Tina 
now we are different because now we are born of Him. We are not just created by God. We are born of God. Now, because of our faith in Jesus, our belief in Christ Jesus, Oh, 
without faith, you cannot please God. Now, by the way, Indian fans understand that our father had a child, so can you fool him with a child? A child that was super young, verse one, who shall not be blamed. Who then was verse two? Who could have been proud of it? That was God. Now, the child that he had was not Kawe. He had not Kawe. He is a easy to be fooled by us. Lama kawe liti zulepo si zonke si sinto ba senza ayo ba senza ando ni kongkongo. Zonke si sinto ba senza ayo ba senza kongkongo. Uwa ma doja awisa ino ma zase chereko. Asuisa ma doja kongkongo. Uko ama doja ala ula uku joseph was a foreigner in Egypt, but he became like the king of Egypt. Now these people, their faith was still looking towards Jesus. Now, faith is the substance. Amen. Now, before, faith was not the substance. Mm -hmm. Faith was, is the substance of things hoped for. Mm -hmm. Faith now, now the call. If faith is the substance of things that were hoped for, let me explain it. Things that were hoped for from the days of Abraham, now, Jesus is the substance of what they were hoping for. Now, what is saying now, now, faith is no longer something that you are hoping for. Faith is a reality, it's a substance. Now, that same faith is living in you, Jesus. Faith is no longer things that we hope for, we don't hope for. Faith is not about hoping, faith is about knowing now, through the living word of God. Faith is the evidence of things that are not seen. The prophet, they did not see him physically. They saw him through visions. The Lord spoke to them. He said, there is one who is coming. He shall be the savior of the world. But he has come. He has not only come, he's living in us now. So faith is not something that's in trouble. Faith comes by hearing and hearing 
hearing the word, I'm telling us the words of God are knowledge. Knowledge. In the spirit, knowledge is very important if you want your faith to grow. If you want to do exploits in this life, you have to educate your faith. As they are growing, their faith must be educated in God. Not only through the word of God, but it's very important. It's very important to listen to ministers of the word of God. It's very important because sometimes now we but there are men who those scrolls have been open to. They have understanding. They can teach you better. Make yes. you understand. Yes. Yes. Now, when you capture revelation, revelation helps your faith to grow. But this is just when you can do one thing through Christ. I barely are. 